The practice of wearing the burqa is not mandated by Islamic law, but some women choose to cover themselves that way. As Indonesian Al Zofatan Faisen reports, the hot issue in Europe is causing little stir here. The latest debate over Islamic practices came when French President Nicolas Sarkozy said last month that the burqa was not welcome in France. That made Muslims around the world examine whether Islam speaks specifically to what women must wear and their right to wear it. The burqa is a head-to-toe body covering garment with only an opening for the eyes. It's rarely seen here in Indonesia, with Muslim women mostly choosing just the jilbab headscarf. Rahmi Auli believes she will receive great rewards in the afterlife for wearing what Indonesians call the chadar. Rahmi merasa nyaman nggak dengan pakaian yang sekarang? Nyaman aja. Sudah berapa lama Rahmi pakai cadar? Sudah empat tahun. Ya, merasa nyamannya karena apa? Ya karena ada mengetahui keutamaannya. Islam's holy book does not call for the wearing of the burqa, only saying followers must cover their bodies, including the head. Some interpret that to include parts of the face, but nothing specific is found in the Quran. Kita tidak menemukan uh, dalil yang kuat untuk uh, mewajibkan bagi wanita muslimah untuk menggunakan cadar. What Islam does teach is that both men and women must cover their bodies in modesty. And that's something women like Rami believe to mean looking out at the world from behind a near total curtain. Zulfat and Faizin, Metro TV. Jelajahi cara baru mendapatkan informasi. Download Metro TV Extend sekarang.